So I'm going to rebuild this. This little 10 millimeter arm isn't working. The wobble is sketchy. <coughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Make scary sounds. And I want something better supporting the motor. And I want to try to move away from the flange so it's in the true DIY spirit. All right, let's do this. All right, in the true DIY spirit, here it is. Finished. I already turned it on. Before I uh, show it off, I just have to bloody clean this workshop because I cannot find my knives. I avoided filming the build of this just because I needed it to get back to work on the uh, the knives I'm working on. Uh, well, he's in his new position. There's always something else to do though. And this wobble is coming from that wooden bench there. So, I think I'm going to have to make a steel fucking bench tomorrow to sit in there which sucks but gonna be worth it when I have a stable machine he's hoping this doesn't take too long I've put way too much time into this and I need to get back into fucking knife making but this will be worth it in the end and then I get to show off an experimental attachment I'm going to try. Alright, let's do this. Alright, there we go. Meant to say metal crate, not wooden crate. And all of the wobble is out of this. It's tracking fine. No wobble. She's doing good. Really fucking happy I made this. I also have this bolt here to adjust to get to that perfect 90 degrees. And I found that really helpful because it meant that I didn't have to make any changes to my bevel jig after fucking around with this because I had the preset 90 degrees. So, what's the next on the agenda? I need to shape this little guy with this. I'm hoping this can be a experimental uh, circular attachment. I don't know what you call that. And that's what I'm hoping for. Then I need to finish this knife and then I have a little carambit to make. And I'm going to make another one of these guys. 